Data logging is all about recording measurements of the physical environment. These graphs show typical results of data logging experiments. The graphs provide a valuable tool for learning and understanding physical phenomena. There are three main steps in the process of obtaining the graphs. We start with sensors that detect and measure physical quantities such as temperature, light and sound. We connect these to the BBC microbit, which performs the next stage of reading and recording the values of from the sensors. Finally, the whole data logging process is managed by iLog software, which tells the microbit what to do and displays the data. Here is how we might observe making a cup of coffee. The control panel shows the sensors we have selected and this button lets us choose the time span for the experiment. To get going with logging, you simply click Start. The light sensor detects when we switch on the light. The sound sensor detects placing the cup on the table. The temperature sensor shows us how hot the coffee is. The home page of iLog gives you lots of ideas for experiments. There are some easy ones to start with and then some more advanced ones. Let's look at some of the easy ones. When you load an experiment, you have a set of instructions for setting up and collecting data. Then there are ideas for using the graphs to find out information from the data. Here are some results to look at. How different colors reflect light. How animals huddled keep warm. How different materials absorb sound. How noise from an alarm depends upon distance. How light varies in different parts of a room. Recording and counting shadows. Mixing hot and cold water. When you have collected data, there are many tools for helping you view and analyze the data. You can decide what to show. You can zoom in on part of the graph. You can look at individual readings or see them in a table. You can use a cursor to take values from the graph or the table. You can plot a nice smooth curve. You can measure change. Or measure rate of change by looking at the line gradient. These are just some of the tools which help you get so much more from graphs as well as just looking at them. Look out for the follow-up videos which show you more data logging techniques with Insight iLog.